middleweight, champion of the world, the Iron Man, Jamel Charlo. We're here, baby. This line's only. Um, I just gotta say, I really appreciate Canelo them and his team, Eddie Reynoso, the whole Canelo team. I appreciate Derek James, Juan Guzman. I, I um, want to give a shout out to PBC, Brittany, Tom Brown, and everybody for even considering me, you know, the little brother of the Charlo twins. Like, uh, you know, how could this fight be such a, a fight that could be sell out to the world and, and, and seems to be so big, but when you got an undisputed and you got a, the undisputed king at 60, 60, uh, 168 and I'm the undisputed king at 54 and, and, and when I got the call, you know, a lot of people were asking that question, you know, they, they didn't understand what was going on. They was listening to the wrong people. You know, ESPN ain't with us and all the reporters that did it all wrong, they didn't understand. But when I got the call, there's nothing that I could say other than jump on it, let's go and let's get it. Because my whole career has been about almost chasing Canelo. You know, like Canelo been a top guy for a long time. And if you want to be great, you always want to just fight the top guy. You want to be, you know, I see Robert Diaz in the crowd because he remember from Golden Boy, um, us always trying to work and trying to possibly get that fight. But it presented itself now, it's here, and I just got to get in there and do my job and be the best that I can do and be the best that I can be. Um, and I'm hoping y'all all come out, you know, get your tickets on a AXS.com, come to T-Mobile Arena. Y'all follow us, tune in, all access, tune in. Y'all, y'all, it's going to be exciting. We're bringing boxing back to the best that it could be this year. And we're going we're gonna to give y'all a, a bang for y'all buck. And um, that's all I got to say. Thank y'all, Lions only.